guys, it's Steph. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming my makeup collection video for you all. Um, I have not a great big collection, but I do have a lot of stuff. So yeah, if you guys have watched my videos before, you have seen this tower thing before. Um, when I did my special effects makeup video, that's kept in the, in the bottom drawer. The second one up from the bottom and like the middle two there have like skincare, hair care, um, foot care, tanning stuff and body all in there. And then this top drawer is my makeup and everything or almost everything on the top is my makeup as well. Just to orient you, that is my window up there. Um, so I do apologise for the glare. I'm not going to stay at this angle for the entire video. Um, and... My mirror is there, don't mind everything in the background. Um, and then my dresser is just on the side over here, like on the other side of the mirror, just like there. Sorry, I'm sitting behind my camera. Um, so yeah, this is my makeup collection, just an overview in all of these drawers and all of that stuff on the top. Um, yeah, so I think I might take you over the top first and then I'll take the drawer out and go through that. Also, just a disclaimer, as you can see, it is under a window and I do live in a an urban setting. So there is a lot of, um, like, dust and stuff comes in through the window quite often. I clean this just about every day, um, but it, it's got marks and stuff on it. Um, so, yeah, just excuse that. But let's just um, jump in. So this is the top of my unit. Um, um, I have a few random things here. So this first thing is my mirror and it is broken there as you can see, but it's like my zoom mirror. So I love it. I'm just going to move it for the purpose of the video so there's no glare. And then move in a little bit further. So I have my hair gel here. Um, and also my current body lotion sitting on top and usually behind that is my hairspray um, but I've been traveling so it's not in there uh, then I have this tower and I can just pull it out and everything sort of moves and opens and stuff um, the extra piece of my mirror is just kept underneath then in this one I have like extra powder puffs and stuff I keep q-tips in the middle one and my extra beauty blenders on the top then I have um, a deodorant here, which is uh, a speed stick, and all of my makeup brushes are kept in this one. And then moving in again, doing this on my tripod was probably a bad idea. I have these two acrylic drawers. Um, so the top one has concealers, the next one is brows. Um, this one is liquid uh, li liquid eyeliners, um, like black ones, my gel liner, and an eyeshadow primer. This one has my coloured liquid and pencil eyeliners in it. This next one has my black and white pencils and also my liquid um, eyeshadow things from Rimmel. And mascaras are in the bottom. And then on the top, I just have this unit here. And I have um, lip glosses, four lip glosses, my lip tint, a lip brush, three... Um, lip liners and my Better Than Sex mascara just because it's too long to fit in these drawers. So, yes, um, I will pull each thing down and go through it with you. Okay, so for the purposes of this video, I'm just going to rest everything on this um, this table that I have here. This is my one of my jewelry organizers in the back behind it, um, and this is just where I put makeup wipes and q-tips and stuff after I've used them so I'm just going to sit here just so I can show you everything um, so this is the one that sits on top of my um, acrylic drawers on the top of my unit <clears throat> so first I have my Too Faced Better Than Sex Waterproof Mascara Holy Grail item right there I have this NYX lip gloss um, a Chi Chi lip gloss I think this one is Rimmel um, another NYX and a kit and then if I just take that out you can see in here I've got three MAC lip liners and just a small lip brush 
So they're all in there. So the first drawer is my concealers. I have two of these Gary Sweet, I think it's Nolte or Multi. Um, I use them for special effects. I have this one from e.l.f. It's the under eye concealer and highlighter. I have a Maybelline Fit Me and my Michelle Fran, my EM Cosmetics, the great cover up. This is amazing. I got this in my recent Bella box and I've used it once and I could do my entire face with like nothing. Like my entire face is foundation. It's great. Next up is my brow drawer. And in here I have a Revlon Colorstay Brow Maker, um, a Maybelline Brow Drama um, Mascara, this NYX Love and Ring eyeshadow palette I actually use, I've taken to using this colour for my brows because it's almost exactly right. So I have that. Um, this one's like a really thin spoolie. This is uh, a Rimmel eyebrow pencil. It's tiny now because I use it like, or I used it all the time, um, but I love the brush on it. Then I have two of these Maybelline um, brow satin pencil and uh, sponge duos. I've got one in dark brown, one in dark blonde. I have very dark brown brows, but I like having the blonde just for um, to lighten up the inside and stuff. Um, and then I have this spoolie, which the handle broke off. I just haven't fixed it yet. And I also keep a pair of tweezers in here. So that's my brow drawer. Next up are my liquid eyeliners. Um, eyeliner pens and my gel liners. Um, so I have a NYX eyeshadow base and this glitter that came from a shop called House of Priscilla. It's like a drag queen kind of central. And then the Maybelline Eye Studio gel liner and also the brush that came with that. Then I have my uh, Maybelline Hyper Sharp Wing and also my Stila Stay All Day liquid liner. Then I have two of these. This one's almost gone and the label's rubbed off, but it's the Maybelline Hyperglossy. Yeah, Hyperglossy Liquid Liner. And then I have this one as well from Rimmel. So that's the third drawer. The fourth drawer down is more my fun stuff. So I've got four of these MAC. Um, retractable eyeliners. I've got a pink, a bronze, a charcoal and a silver. Let's just move those out. And then I've got all of these BYS ones that I just use for like adding a bit of sparkle. So two silvers, a purple, a bold silver, two electric blue greens, uh, two electric blue blues, this like um, khaki kind of green. And then I also have this one which is um, from Avon. It's the same sort of colour. So I just keep all of those together, just because I don't reach for them all that often. This is the next drawer. I have my liquid eyeshadows with their glitter counterparts because they're like two part, um, two piece items. So it's the G drawer, uh, the go for applicator with a glittered brush. I love those. I want to get more of those actually because they are really good, but I'm running out of storage. And then I have um, a Maybelline mask liner. This is like a retractable one, I'm pretty sure. Like, yeah. I have that. Um, I have my MAC Smolder. I need a new one of those. And also my MAC um, Engraved. They're my two blacks that I use. I just have this Starlet Black here. Um, and then I have a G NYX. Milk Jumbo Eye Pencil, and this one is from Rimmel, and it's just a soft coal white eyeliner. So I love those. And then the last one just has my three mascaras, my other three mascaras in it. I have the Rimmel um, Glam Eyes Day Tonight. I love that. It's nearly gone. Maybelline Falsies is nearly gone, and I have this one as well, which is from Maybelline, and it's Grey Lash. My sister recommended this, and I do quite like it for um, easy days. So coming into the drawer now, it's completely full. Um, so in the back here I have some eyeshadows, a couple of products down there. I've filled up down the side and all the different compartments are full as well. So I'm actually going to take this one out and go through it with you um, piece by piece. 
So this is what the inside of the drawer looks like. Um, I have these acrylic organizers that you can see um, in there. There's a couple of different pieces. So here I just have three sleek eyeshadow palettes and then tucked in the back here I have a MAC BB cream and underneath that just a uh, retractable bronzer. In the front here I have all of my liquid, uh, not my liquid, my cream eyeshadows, my single powder eyeshadows and all my lashes. Just an eyeshadow palette, palette that didn't fit with the rest and some extra bronzers and blush. This is also my eyelash glue. Then I've got my e.l.f. brush shampoo and my e.l.f brush cleaner, a couple more single eyeshadows down there that didn't fit in there. This is a cream concealer palette, I have my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. All of this is my eyeshadow palettes here, um, and there's like a little quad just tucked down there. This is my Makeup Mist and Set, my two Kabuki brushes and my two Daily Beauty Blenders are in here as well. This one's like a mini and then my normal Beauty Blender. In here I've got an extra bronzer, an extra pressed powder and an extra loose powder which is a shade darker than mine if I want to be a little bit more bronzy and also my Body Shop Tea Tree Blotting Paper. Moving into this front section here I've got my NYX Pore Filler Primers and also my Photo Loving Primer in the Anti Redness. All my liquid foundations are here. I have um, a foundation stick just there and a beauty cream just here. And my face powder is there. I have two extra um, liquids just here. These are by Starlet. I use them for special effects mostly and both of my sharpeners in here. Down the side I have a pressed powder that I use all the time and my main contour and highlighting palette. And then I've got two concealer, concealer sticks in here and the rest is all lipstick. So, yes. I use mostly Maybelline and Rimmel, as you can tell, I'm starting to get back into high-end makeup and things like that, and I've got a couple, like my face powder here is on CoverGirl, I have a lot of NYX as well. So that's going to be it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed, if you did please give me a thumbs up, comment down below if you want an in-depth um, like collection video or swatches of anything, or if you have any questions or comments. Um, I'd be happy to answer them and I'd love to try and do some makeup videos. So if you have any suggestions for things you'd like to see, also let me know that. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of my other content. And open that description box to find my friends and my social media links are all linked down below as well. I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye.